Hey, what's up? Welcome to my basement workshop, which I have dubbed Design 8 Studio. This is the conclusion of a small three-part series on how I made some logo wall art for my studio. And in the first video, I briefly showed how I used my Lowrider 3 CNC plasma cutting rig to cut out the metal portion of the combo and in the second video, I showed briefly my process for getting the box edges folded on the metal. But from the start, it was always my plan to combine metalworking, plasma cutting, together with woodworking and 3D printing to create a combo structure that would really set things off in a nice way in my shop. Well, I've got it complete now, and you're seeing there just an incomplete first test of the LEDs. So I just briefly wanted to run through my process for getting all of this put together. Uh, when I first got the wood cut out, which was cut on my first Lowrider 3 CNC, which carries a router instead of a plasma torch. Then I did some sanding and I had to first put a coat of pre-stain on and then after the pre-stain some honey oak stain. And once I had the wood all prepped, then I designed some 3D printed standoffs and planned how I would route the wiring uh, on the back side of the wood and in through one of the standoffs out to where the metal was. Uh, finally uh, bringing the power to the LEDs, which are hidden on the back side, on the box lip edges of the plasma cup metal. And so it's up and really looking sharp. I'm really pleased with it. I would encourage you, if you have a, a desire to do some plasma cutting, uh, I, I can't think of any more affordable and more impressive way to get it done than to build a Lowrider 3 CNC. Check out v1engineering.com. The design for the CNC is given away free by Ryan, the founder. And there's a great community there in the V1 Engineering Forum. And while plasma is a little bit outside the normal workflow, uh, there is some great help from some forum members there and the founder, Ryan. And I'm happy to help myself, uh, but I would encourage you, even though it's it's a steeper learning curve than just building a regular lowrider, it's really been worth it for me to build this plasma-based lowrider. I've just been super, super pleased with the results. And I also want to give a shout out to uh, Linux CNC and the folks at the Linux CNC forum. They have been just a tremendous help. And between the two forums, the V1 Engineering Forum and the Linux CNC Forum, uh, I've just really just found uh, tremendous help and answers to all my questions. And I'm, I'm so pleased to have this rig up and running. And uh, I've documented my build on the V1 Engineering Forum. And uh, until the next video, I wish you happy making.